Welcome back to another round of Cooperative Let's Play GeoGuessr. With me is Marit. Hello. We're going to try with the normal rules of the two minute time limit and the challenge link is in the description. Let's see the world. Ah, okay, so European? Maybe? Al oh, Algestorp? Could be Swedish, but... Yeah? yeah. Okay, I thought I, I think the Swedish road signs may be in capitals, but I may be wrong on that. It could be. Um, that's just as something that I've used in the past, but I may be wrong. Uh, oh, what oh, does no, that? Chilskeder. No. That, that's not. Is that Swedish? I have no idea what that is. Actually, it okay. looks Swedish, but it's got the it's got the umlauted A's. It didn't look German. That's weird. Circus. Uh, oh yeah, it must be Swedish. Yeah. Okay. How's All right, so um, I, I retract my previous statement about capitalization. Wow, look at these huge things That's here. Big, yeah. Well, we are in farm country, it seems. We are. Uh, let's move faster because we want to get... Uh, we can't really move as fast using the hold down the cursor key thing. I haven't actually been using the cursor keys in pre previous rounds of GeoGuessr. Amara pointed out that it is a much better way to scan... Uh, at, at well, speed. Well, helps when the mouse is bugging out, basically. Yeah. Uh, right, which it frequently does. Oh, here's some sign. Ah, yeah. oh, here we are. Now, this is a major, a more major road. Lindbergh, Lindbergh. 5. That sounds like it could be a Swedish place. And those are the road signs that I've recognised, that I thought that was were Swedish road mm. signs, those capital ones. So, obviously, the minor roads don't aren't in caps, so that was my mistake. Um... So, Lindberg. we're not going to be able to get the distance to f five kilometers in 18 seconds. So I think we're going to, we are limited to making a guess here. We have a lot of bergs here, Gothenburg, mm -hmm. Varberg, Falkenberg in the south. Um, but mm. oh, six seconds. The name is too generic for me to guess. Okay, let's just put ourselves somewhere in Sweden. Okay, okay, well, actually, we should have probably gone in the middle of all these bergs because it turns out pretty much in the middle is where we were. Mm. Uh, but still, uh, 164 miles uh, too far north. 4,207 points, that's not too bad. No. On to round two. They drive on the right and they stick their bare arms out of the car uh, as they drive. Uh, they have a cross on the side of the road. Mm -hmm. uh, so I guess they're a very Christian country. Maybe they're Pro Catholic. Probably Catholic, yeah. Uh, but where are we? We haven't well, seen any writing. Right now. Oh, hang on. No, here's a, here's a better one. Uh, we've got lots of writing on that one. Whoops. Uh, okay, right. So, what do we see here? This is... This is Romania. Oh, Romania. Okay. Uh, Don't ask me where. All right, well, that's, it's given us a country, and mm -hmm. maybe uh, maybe now we can uh, we can get somewhere else. What did that say? Well, this is... That must be the name of the river, right? Trotus. Mm. Uh, that this that this bridge is, is over. Where is Romania? Uh, of course, they're not exactly prominently uh, labelled or marked, the rivers. And this is probably not even the major one. It's certainly not the Danube, so I don't know why I'm looking at that. Um, okay, let's turn around and go back into what I guess look more like a town in this direction. Maybe we find something there. Some signs would be nice. Yeah, some road signs with some destinations on. Very some towns. If we have to drop, what was that? Hey, nice. Oh, nice. Uh, if we have to drop, uh, that, I guess that those are uh, those are Romani people in Romania, fittingly. Yeah, I guess there would be. Uh, what was that sign? Where'd it go? I don't know. Uh, I just overshot it, was... it, Miles. Uh, cabinet medical. medical. All right, we got nothing we can that go on here. Cool. We just have to guess. Sh sh shall we um, drop a pin in the middle of Romania and hope? Okay. Um... I think that's the best we can do under the circumstances. Uh, okay, we were 88 miles too far southwest. Uh, we were up in this area here near Plopu. And there's the river. The River Trotus. Yes. There we go. The Trotus. I'm not sure how you pronounce that S. That, that river is just basically vanishes at the sort of, um, the sort of uh, zoom levels that we would, could, could have seen it. I think here it really only becomes visible. Mm. So I don't think we really have much chance of getting uh, close to it. We didn't see this, this road name 12A, which might have helped us as well. 
but still 4,556 points. I can live with that. Yeah, me too. Okay, that was round two, wasn't it? This is amateur night at the Geoguessa Bar. <laughs> I think this round is going pretty well. Yeah, okay. we're going to totally crash now, aren't we? Yeah, we probably are. <laughs> All right, on to round three. And, oh, uh, gosh, oh look at this. This is bad quality. This is bad quality, and look at oh, where my. we are. Like, could we be <laughs> any further away from any sort of signs of identifying civilization? No. Uh, there's a bend in the road. Well, that's helpful. We're near a bend that turns right. I know where we are. Oh, yeah. No. We're near that bend. We're near a bend. A 90 degree bend. Uh, are they buildings up there or just like... It could be buildings or just blobs of... Yeah. Oh, no, it's buildings. Maybe they're really large cows. <laughs> um, yeah. Let's see. Uh, not that this is necessarily going to help us. Oh, yeah, then we've got sort of grain silos. Whoa, what was that? Um, oh, we've no, got a couple of street roads. names yeah. or numbers, actually, but that doesn't tell us no. what we need to know most of all is which state we're in. Yes, and hurt. we appear to be in the state of being completely in the middle of nowhere. A red barn. Maybe we're in one of the... Um, yes, several red barns. Okay. Maybe we're in one of the states where they have Norwegian. We could be, but this, this sort of open... this. This sort of open farmland, kind of, I don't know. I I I expect in 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 countries like um, like Minnesota, um, I, mm. the 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 landscape is a lot more interesting than this. And I wouldn't really know. I, we have nothing else to go on, so we might as well guess that. And you may well be right. Um, but yeah, you're right. They they do look. They do have the sort of Scandinavian style, um, barns here. But and now it's sort of winding it a little bit more. A... I suspect, I, I, I've, I, also the places where we've, it could be, the places where I've seen that, the places when we've been in Minnesota and Wisconsin, the imagery has been a lot better, but I have nothing else to go on. So I'm just going to put us, let's put us in that sort of general area and hope. Hey, not too bad at all, actually. We were about 124 miles too far north. We were in Illinois, uh, not far from Paris and uh, Terre Haute. 4,390 points. Nice one. Okay, fifth and final round. Ugh. Australia? Australia, maybe? maybe. We are on um, some very dry grassland. Bad quality imaging again. Yeah. Uh, fence posts and wire fences. Very dry place. This definitely looks like the outback to me. Or it looks, not that I've ever been to the outback, but it looks like my expectation of what the outback looks like. Yeah. Um, probably wrongly. Um, well, it could be somewhere in America too, I guess. They have quite dry places there it too. It could be. If we pass a vehicle... That wouldn't hurt. Yeah. Um, but it feels like the kind of place that we could drive for a long time and not see one. It's very desolate, isn't it? Really? I think this Google Street View car is, is, is one of the few on the road. It's just a dirt road. No, uh, can't read that yeah, either. unless a sign is really big or very close to us, I don't think we have much of a chance of reading any text. Really. Is that a school? Is this a school? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Well, we have a small community here. Okay, so we, there must be something we can read here, surely. Maybe. Uh, just a few buildings. Now, mm -hmm. what does that say? Faust Hill? Something Hill. Foothill? Oh, foot, I think it looks says Foothill. Maybe. Let's say it does say Foothill. It doesn't help us. Yeah. Is that a sign? No. Where? Well, I think you passed it now. Okay. Maybe. Yeah, oh, there. there is something here. Yes. Foothill. Oh, it's impossible, something. isn't it? Yeah, we got 20 seconds here and it's just... Oh, I wish Unless they'd replace kinda... this bad imagery so we could yeah. just have a chance to read the signs. Yeah, absolutely. Not that it would um, particularly... Get us, uh, oh, nice horses. Mm. Uh, all right, well, let's go for the balance of gravity in, in New South Wales. Ah, okay, Tasmania. Oh, that wasn't oh, too bad. Tasmania, we were 500 huh? odd miles too far north. Tasmania, yeah, that's the first time I've seen Tasmania come up on GeoGuessr, unless I'm mistaken. Yeah. We're a little further north 
a little north of Hobart. Now there were probably clues there that we were on Tasmania, probably the probably something oh, yeah. probably someone in Australia or from, from Tasmania was just shouting at the screen there saying, This looks really Tasmanian, how can you miss it? But I don't know what Tasmania looks like, I'm sorry. Two thousand seven hundred points there. Oh, that wasn't round five, that must have been round four. Okay, so uh, so given that that was not the final round, and this is, let's see. Ah, okay. Red again. Okay. Red, yes, we have a lot of red. A bit of brick building here as well. Mm -hmm. uh, that doesn't look like the kind of thing I would expect to see in Norway personally, but then I'm not the Norwegian. How about you? Well, there wasn't a, an American mailbox that I could see, so... Uh... Yeah? Oh, we got a sign oh. here. Oh, ah. oh, this is in Sweden, Sweden. Somewhere, I would think. Yeah. Okay. So that little tiny place there, let's try and uh, get somewhere more major faster. The problem is in Sweden that sometimes the, pl uh, uh, sometimes the more major place is like 500 miles away. Yeah. So uh, where can we go? What can we find? What can we hope to find that will get us a bit more specific than just Sweden? Mm, ah, leader. leader. I say we carry on around along this this uh, this road and hope that there's a junction with a major road. Nice cows. Yeah, there are some nice stocky cows there. Mm -hmm. Swedish cattle. Yeah. Uh, so I think we've so we're we're pretty confident that this is Sweden. Yeah, I would I would say Sweden. Okay. Um, Certainly not Norway. Any idea what sort of part of Sweden that might be? No, we're in the okay. country somewhere. Yeah. Obviously, okay, I don't know city. if I... Did I just get turned around? I think so. I don't know. I think I'm going the same direction because we didn't... I haven't seen houses. Um. Oh, oh what did that say? Uh, it was probably just another... Oh, man, it's miles back. All right, well, 20 seconds anyway. So we're just going to have to just drop a pin in Sweden. All right, where do you, where do you <sighs> say? I don't know. All right, tell me when to stop. Well, just put it where you feel like it, because your guess is as good as mine here. Okay, it's there. Really? Oh, uh, good job. Not too bad. Uh, uh, for a guess, yeah. I would say that's good. Probably should have gone a little further south there. Uh, uh, to be honest, I think I assume that in the, the same way as in uh, as in Norway, the the majority of people live like in the non-polar regions of the country, so... Oh, we prefer a little bit of warmth, at least. Yeah, absolutely. That's why you're here and not in uh, not in Norway in December. <laughs> um, so, yeah, just basically on a, a forest road in the middle of nowhere, not uh, quite a long distance from the nearest uh, major town there. 4,127 points. Let's look at the summary. Okay, we were just 20 points shy of 20,000. That was a good round. Yeah, that's the best we've had so far, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. And we can see that here on the scoreboard. Not only our best cooperative score so far, but the second best score of the entire series overall. So if you played along, I hope you got a good score. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.